Hello friends, it's me. And today I am here with me, Digital Max. Today we're gonna to be watching a video about a pregnant cheerleader who gets <laughs> <laughs> who gets <laughs> shut up. Okay. Who gets kicked off her team. Pop because she's pregnant. <laughs> you got a point. Coming up in this video. Hey, wait, that's not Dar Matt. <laughs> I'm off the squad. Just like that. That's just wrong. I can't do this without you. Yeah, we should all quit. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> the acting always gets me. <laughs> well, the acting is so good, it's like I was there. <laughs> the camera shaking. <laughs> B R O C K. Mom, C. That didn't even rhyme. Right, good, good girls, that was good. That was good, not great. Do better next time. Ashley? Did you not work out this summer? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Are you gonna say that? that? That's a one-way ticket to get canceled. <laughs> Jessica, did you wear makeup today? <laughs> you girls hit the showers. You need to stay behind. We need to work on a fitness routine. I'm already doing all I can. I mean, technically she was working out. <laughs> <laughs> How many calories does baby making burn? <laughs> Look, our cheerleaders are slim and trim. I expect you to be the same. There's nothing wrong with my cheer. I'm doing just as good, if not better, than the other girls. Oh, don't let them hear you say that. <laughs> All right, go, go hit the, the treadmill, treadmill and we'll see, see how, how you do tomorrow. tomorrow. But I thought we were gonna shower. Treadmill! Okay, you're the coach. But if the coach told you to jump off a cliff, would you do it? Finally, more pizza. I thought we were gonna run out. Boy, you're hungry. I've never seen you eat this much. Did you skip breakfast? Today you just call an out day? Like Today is just fat shaming day. Everybody's in a fat shaming mood today. Especially the girl dressed like a minion. <laughs> oh, I had two omelets and a stack of blueberry pancakes. My favorite. The coat is gonna be mad at you. Y'all are so rude. Let her have her pizza. Are you okay? Maybe it's stress eating. I ate breakfast. Are you okay? Is there something physically wrong with you for eating breakfast? No, I'm eating for two. <gasps> oh, is your boyfriend fasting or something? Are you stupid? Are you stupid? <laughs> <laughs> when someone rubs their belly and says I'm eating for two, what do you think it means? Is your boyfriend not eating so you're eating for him? How nice of you, you're so considerate. Oh, no, no, no. He's having a baby. <gasps> He's having a baby? Oh my goodness, you figured it out. <laughs> Finally, the men are having babies. Oh no. <laughs> Men can't have babies. <laughs> no, silly. He's having a baby with me. Then why did you say he was pregnant, idiot? I like how she keeps pointing at I herself. Know. How many hints do they need to understand? Wow! Well, that's so exciting. Is it safe to cheer? Haven't you read Dr. Brock? Dr. Brock? Who's he? Were they cheering B-R-O-C-K in the beginning? What you mean who's Dr. Brock? Does he write pregnancy books or something? Hello? Why do you think they call our school Brock University? Y'all idiots for real. How's the pregnant girl the smartest one? <laughs> <laughs> My blast two brain cells having a conversation with each other. Dr. Brock? He wrote all those books back in the 70s. He's the world's biggest biggest expert on babies. Brock the baby expert started a university and that's what inspired her to get pregnant. Oh, I saw his statue in front of the administration building. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize that was him. No, we know. You know, we go to Brock University. We literally spell it out when we cheer. I never heard of that guy. <laughs> For girls like me, it's okay to have physical activity early in the pregnancy. Good, I was worried. For girls like me, she's such a pick me. <laughs> <laughs> Waiter, more pizza over here for her. <laughs> oh, so now it's okay Ashley to eat more pizza. just revealed she's expecting, but what will she do about Who's cheer? talking? If it's not a darn man, no one cares. R is for ready. O is for offense. C is for champion. K is for kick butt. Rock, three, rock. All right, that was pretty good. What's with you two with the jewelry? I don't want to see you wearing that for the game. And you, how many times have I told you don't wear your hair down. This isn't a nightclub. Oh, what does putting your hair down have to do with a nightclub? Oh, the coach is going to party. Oh my, Ashley, you're bigger than yesterday. <laughs> what, are you storing food in there for the oh winner? Oh my God. Whatever you say, coach. I only wear them during practice. Okay, won't happen again. What's your excuse, can't Ashley? Help <laughs> can't help it, bro, I'm pregnant. Are you gonna be a problem around here? At least for another nine months, I, I will be. You can't <laughs> the team. I think you have to tell her. If it's like this now, imagine what it's gonna be like next week. 
Yeah, she's gonna double in size, maybe triple. By the end of the month, she'll be a beluga. Coach, I need to talk to you about something. Is there somewhere private we can go? What do you mean private? You literally just told everyone yesterday. Wow, you sure got a lot of stuff in here for a coffee shop. That's a nice green screen. <laughs> Why do you look like a lab? Why is there a cheese grater? Are this supposed to be a kitchen? That ain't no kitchen. No, this is the kitchen for the teacher's oh, lounge. Okay. Here, I brought you a cup. Oh no, I can't have caffeine right now. Right now? What's going on? You can't have caffeine? What's wrong with you? Red flags everywhere. I'm having a baby. No, <gasps> not on my team. You didn't even give her a chance to say anything. <laughs> no. But don't worry, I can still do cheer. Well, that's not up to you now, is it? Last time I checked, I was coach. I decide who's on the squad and who's off. But I'm captain of the squad. Not anymore, you're not. You're demoting me? Who's gonna be captain of the squad? There's three other girls that can take <laughs> your spot. Who's gonna lead the cheer team? Oh, I haven't decided yet. And you're not demoted. That's good news. Off. I thought you said I was demoted and I wasn't captain anymore. No, you said that, <laughs> idiot. Have you tried listening? You're not captain anymore because you're off the team. What? I can't be off the team. I do a great job. Can't do Clearly. a great job pregnant. I know. <laughs> you can't like like, do cheer and be pregnant? Like, what if somebody that just like, no more there's babies? A, yeah, there's a lot why? of reasons why you shouldn't be yeah. cheerleading while pregnant. Can't have a pregnant cheerleader here at Brock University. What kind of message did that send to alumni and other students? Dr. Brock was the baby expert. Yeah, he was planting babies inside people since 1970. <laughs> it is my duty to go to Brock University and get pregnant to make Dr. Brock proud. <laughs> Look, this isn't the 1900s. Pregnant women have rights too. <laughs> I guess. She's so smart. <laughs> Not on my squad. <gasps> she said pregnant women don't have rights. Cancel her immediately. Besides, what would old man Brock say if he saw a pregnant cheerleader at one of our sporting events? Mm. He'd say, nice. <laughs> <laughs> He'd be proud of me. <laughs> He's the baby expert after all. After all, he's the most famous pregnancy author there is. He's probably old fashioned like me. He knows where a pregnant woman's place is. Oh yeah, and where's that? Not on my cheer squad, now go clean out your locker. You're gonna regret this. Do you really think she's gonna be mad? You know how Coach is. Coach A. Coach A? Coach A. <laughs> you know how Coach is. Did they just spell it? Coach A. <laughs> There's like low budget, uh, the, there's this. Well girls, I'm off the squad, just like that. Off the squad? She can't do that. Coochie can do whatever she wants. <laughs> <laughs> well, she's the coach. I can't force her to keep me. That's just wrong. I can't do this without you. Yeah, we should all quit. Then what? No more cheer squad? You guys should all get pregnant in defiance. <laughs> You can't quit. You can make more of a difference on the team than off. She's right. People need to know about this. We need to make a video. Yeah, expose Yeah, her. if people knew what was going on, the school would have to respond. What would the school say? <gasps> Dr. Brock might show up himself. He might jump out of his statue and be like, <laughs> no, put her back on the team. Until today, I was cheer captain at Brock University. And now I'm no longer part of the cheer team because I'm pregnant. And the coach said she can kick someone off her team for any reason or no reason at all. Okay, what do you want? Did they call the president of the United States? <laughs> Put her back on the cheer team. Dean Kepler. Sir, you better check the news. We're getting bad publicity. <laughs> Are you kidding me? The school's getting canceled. I'll look into it. Hmm, what's this about? Dean Kepler. Bob Johnstone, Channel 7 News. We need a comment on this pregnancy story. <laughs> <laughs> Bro looks so ridiculous with his yellow phone. What is this, the Krusty Krab? <laughs> uh, I'm not making any comments to the press. You don't even know what's going on. It's 2020, why do you still have a wired phone? Dean Kepler. There's an important call on line two. You're gonna wanna take this. Hold all my calls, we have a crisis. You don't understand, this is Dr. Brock. <gasps> He's still alive? <laughs> He's like 100 years old, bro. Having all those babies kept them young. And girls keep cheering, you look really disorganized. We're just not the same without a cap. Well, she's not coming back, and I don't wanna see you three slacking anymore. Why is she treating them like a horrible manager? Like, you signed up for this job. You guys need a fort? She's back! <laughs> So you know, tigers are supposed to have cubs. Oh my god. Tigers are supposed to have cubs. Not in high school. We are the tigers. Red, black, and white. We are back as one, and we're gonna fight. Fight, fight. You're the worst cheerleaders I've ever seen. Just what do you think you're doing? We're cheering. Yeah, 
That's what we're supposed to do. Not with her on the team, you're not. Oh, really? Well, you know what? Maybe we'll quit this team. Well, maybe it would be easier to have you all kicked out of Brock University. She's like, good, less work for me. True. <laughs> <laughs> all y'all can leave, go home. I don't like this job anyway. How are you going to do that? That's easy. The dean recruited me. He'll do what I say. Chill, bro, he just hired you. If I want these students kicked out of the school for no reason at all, he'll kick them off the school for no reason at all. Coach Williams, I need to speak with you. Now. Ooh, Dean Kepler. In of course. Look, if this is about the pregnant cheerleader, I can explain. That's exactly what this is about. I kicked her off the squad. She came back completely unauthorized. You kicked her off the squad? What for? P look at her. She's pregnant. <laughs> not because it's not safe for someone who's pregnant to be cheerleading. Because look at her. She's pregnant. I don't know if you noticed. She got big really fast. I've told you in a few days she'll be the size of a whale. We're aware that our founder is the most famous baby doctor of all time. So now a baby doctor. So first of all, this dude was a baby expert, and then he was a pregnancy author, and now he a baby doctor. He all things baby. Maybe he is baby himself. He called me, in fact, quite up in arms. Well, I can assure you, I wouldn't want to do anything to embarrass this university that bears his name. What is this Kingdom Hearts music? <laughs> I don't know. He made it very clear to me that in his book, it's quite appropriate for someone who is physically active to stay active during early pregnancy. They were citing this like it's the law of the land. Also, when they say active, cheerleaders don't just stand there and do this. Let's I be know. honest. They're gonna be flipping around cartwheeling and doing other cool stuff. Yeah, what is woo? Yeah, they don't just sit there and do that. It's like a shake weight. Well, he may be right, but we can't have somebody like that parading around during our sporting events. Well, he feels completely the opposite. Okay. I mean, do you want me to let her back on the team? No, that won't be necessary. Oh, so it'll be my call. Well, actually, it's not your call. They're not even looking at each other. They both recorded this separately, the green screen, and then put them together. Look, they're not even looking at each other. They're looking at an invisible person in the middle. Listen, eye contact wasn't in the budget, all right? He couldn't afford it. Leave him alone. Dr. Brock doesn't believe in eye contact. Only poorly edited videos. Because you're fired. Who are you what? talking to? Who's fired? Who are you talking to? Yes, who's fired, Dean? <laughs> yeah, just did. The person in the middle? <laughs> Look at the camera and make a surprise face. <gasps> just because things were done a certain way in the past doesn't mean it's appropriate today. What do you mean? Wasn't that the whole point? That what Professor Brock said in the past is still valid today, right? I'm so confused after this message. Me too. That was one of the single worst pieces of media I've ever watched. They were literally just like, oh my God, I have a million dollar idea. <laughs> Pregnant cheerleader gets kicked off the team. Genius. Y'all didn't even have enough budget to show Mr. Brock himself. He's the star of the show. I was waiting for him to pop up on the screen. Very disappointing. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button in the face. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click. Click. And I just released some new merch. We got hoodie shirts, tank tops at ogwolfpack.com. I'll link it below. And subscribe, join the wolf pack. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye guys. Bye. Weak howl. Ah! Do it. Bye.